What's going on, party people? What is going on? It's your ride chair extraordinaire, your super duper Uber drivers here, guys. Yeah, thank you, thank you. You guys already know the deal. Before you hop in my ride, do me a favor, hit the like, hit that subscribe, poor favor. <laughs> Come on, let's do this. Hop on in, buckle in. And let's go. Yeah! Okay, okay. Party people, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, thank you for hitting that subscribe button. All right, folks, what are we talking about today, folks? Man, another power couple has broken up. Yeah. Love is in the air, and so is divorce. It's a new thing. Divorce is the new thing now. Have we all seen the news? J-Lo and Ben Affleck are calling the quits. Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck are taking some space amid continued rumors of marriage tension. A source tells Access Hollywood that the pair is living apart as speculation swirls about the future of their relationship. And this time... Ben Affleck is the one who filed the paperwork. Had enough of this shit. Had enough of J-Lo. Goodness gracious. Man, J-Lo, this is her fourth marriage. She's been married. This marriage right here is going to last, what, two years? It didn't even make two years yet. She had another marriage with Noah, two years. She had another one with Chris Judd, two years. The one with Mark Anthony, I think Mark Anthony is about the longest she had been married, 10 years. So she's another hopeless romantic. Oh my God, she's a mess. She's a mess. She dated Drake. She dated uh, A-Rod. She dated a, a few celebrities, P. Diddy. She's just a hopeless romantic and never get it right. She have this idea of marriage or what a relationship should be like and if you don't play the role that's in her mind, she's going to walk around. Hur, 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 hur. Ben Affleck said, fuck this shit. There's the old saying, do not eat your throw up. In a relationship, it's the same thing. If you break up with somebody, there's a reason why you broke up with her. They was engaged the first time. They broke up. He did a rebound and married the other Jennifer. Dropped some kids and all that stuff. They get divorced. And his dumb ass, he goes back to Jennifer Lopez and marry her. Man. And instantly, he regrets it. Look at his photos here. <laughs> He remembered why they broke up in the first place. She's an egomaniac. Man. So now she's 54. She's going to be back on the, back on the block. And she's going to be looking for love again. So all you young guys out there, she's 54. You know what that means, right? She's cougar now. Yes. So she's going to be looking for young meat. You guys, you successful guys out there. Beware, she's on the prowl. She's going to be coming looking for love again, all right? So, fair warning. You see J-Lo and that big booty ass come around. <laughs> Remember, it's all Spanx. It's all tucked away. Once you take all the Spanx off, her real body going to show up. She's going through menopause. I'm in menopause! Okay? Yeah. So, you guys, just because she's J-Lo and she got money and fame, it comes with a cost. It comes with a cost. The other saying is, behind every beautiful woman, 
there's a guy who's tired of her shit. And she got a whole list of people who is tired of her shit. So you got a track record. You're not going to be nothing different. You're not going to, you know, have the big schlong. You can kiss her ass. She's mentally unstable because she believe in romance. Think you got a GBS, you don't. Think I'm going to spend your cash on. Even if you were broke, my love don't cost a thing. Think I want to drive your bands, I don't. If I want to cross, I got my own. Even if you were broke, my love don't cost a thing. She's 50 years old and she still believe in romance. She can't get that shit out of her head. She don't know what the marriage is. She likes the wedding, but the marriage part, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. And that goes with a lot of young ladies out here. They love the weddings. They love the rings. But the marriage part, the hard work, they want no part of that. And she showed that she cannot do it. So, <laughs> so all you young guys out there, you up-and-coming basketball players, you up-and-coming no. football players, you rappers, beware of J-Lo because she's out there and she's going to be looking for somebody to fill in that hole for her. And if you don't make it, she's going to blame you. All right? So that's all I got for you guys today. If you got any value out of my content, do me a favor. Hit the like. Hit that subscribe. You see that notification bell? Turn on that notification bell so you get my latest and greatest. Share this content with your best friends. And tell your mama I said hi. <laughs> all right, all right. Till next time, guys, I'll see you again. And all you hopeless romantic, get your ass off my lawn.